New tonight, an historic day in Fall River as demolition began on a vacant mill complex here that's been a source of trouble for years. Neighbors watched as a crane began taking down two of the King Philip Mill buildings, bringing to an end a decade-long saga. Eyewitness News anchor Caroline Goggin joins us now live from the newsroom with more. Caroline? Well, Mike, neighbors watched today as demolition began on the 750-square-foot property, which recently sold for $195,000 after being on the market for nearly five years. Now, demolition began on the first of three buildings at the mill complex on Kilburn Street. The other two will be demolished over the next four months, and the demolition of these buildings will allow access to Cook Pond for the first time in 100 years. The mill has been vacant and abandoned for the past 13 years, and, and it's been an eyesore and public safety hazard because of a fire threat. In January of 2012, flames erupted there. It was later determined that fire was intentionally set. The man responsible sentenced to 12 years in prison. Neighbors have been petitioning city officials for years to bring it down. This is a, a property that has plagued this neighborhood, has been a fire hazard, an eyesore, uh, has prevented people from getting access to our beautiful Cook Pond uh, for about 13 years. And the mill will be replaced with 26 single-family homes. The third building will be remodeled for mixed-use space. I'm Caroline Goggin, Eyewitness News.